Hey guys, it's me, honey, and I, and you guys wouldn't believe what we're about to do. I just left from getting my uh, checkup on my surgery wound, and so we have the day off today. It's Friday, and we don't have too much to do, so we are going to grab some lunch and we're gonna go to the car wash because they have one dollar car washes at this new car wash here in town so we're gonna take you guys along with us hope you have fun <laughs> So yesterday was the first day that they opened this place. And it was packed. Hi. No. Walmart over here next to it. Got the Dollar Tree, Dollar General. They're backing up on him. <laughs> I don't think any of them are. Lord have mercy. This white car is just forwards and backwards. have hydraulics. <laughs> Lord have mercy. Time 
have to drive. say you go inside the building and sign up for your membership where it's ten dollars a month for unlimited car washes and uh, I think honey is going to sign up for the unlimited aren't you? Yeah. She's always trying to wash the car. Here honey can you Throw that away for me, please. Thank you. Now, comment down below. Do you guys dry your car off after you go through the car wash, or do you just leave the water spots on there and just speed off? Let us know, because um, we don't just speed off. We dry it off and make sure that there's no water spots. Otherwise, what's the point in getting a car wash? Because wouldn't it still have like the same water spots as uh if your car got rained on i mean i understand if you are crunched on time or something like that but then again why wouldn't you just wait until you have time to go get it washed and dry it and do it right and do you vacuum your car out or do you just leave it and just do the car wash let me know comment down below also, I just want to talk about my new doctor's office that I just came from. As I mentioned earlier, I have to go to to get my um, checkups from after post-surgery. And they just check on uh, my wound or whatever from the incision from surgery. And so, this doctor's office is so cool, guys. Like, they, when you come in... They offer you something to drink and of course a lot of places have like a water fountain or whatever but they actually offer ice water which all of y'all know I honey loves her ice and her water like no matter where I'm at I always have water I have water in my bag down below just because I always like to carry some water with me but it's not just regular old ice cubes it's the ice chips which they had me at hello with that then they asked me well do you want something to drink ma'am and i was like sure what do you guys have ice water and then she was like yes we have water we have coffee we have cranberry apple orange juice she said we have um sprite coke both regular or diet and i was like what like they are treating people like more than just regular old patients and then after i told her okay i'll just take a ice water then she was like would you like something to eat and i was like what they're all up here offering people something to eat i said well what do you have because i was curious i ain't never heard of that before she said we have muffins for our um patients she said oh you guys see her back there <laughs> little shorty uh, she was like we have blueberry and we have banana nut and I said yes I would like a muffin and she came back and not only did she come back with the muffin still in the package but she done opened it and warmed it up in the microwave y'all 
I'm like, dang. And she came in and, you know, brought the, you know, refreshments and took my vitals at the same time. And I was like, dang. You know, a lot of places are doing stuff like to be hospitable to their guests. Like, even when you see the nail salons and stuff where they're offering people champagne or wine. They, I really had that in Texas, that kind of treatment. But they don't have that here. And so, like, when you see people uh, on the shows where they go and... Like when you see on the shows where people go get like a wedding dress or whatever and they offer the bridal party wine, champagne, they don't have that here. So it's always nice to be treated like your business is valuable and like pampered a little bit, like to get pampered a little bit. That's nice. Also, everybody, I want y'all to comment down below and tell us what part of the muffin do you like the best is it the top of the muffin the round part or is it the bottom i like the top part what do you like honey i'm a topper <laughs> no you didn't <laughs> what you did not need to say that why do you know what that means yeah it's true on both ends lord <laughs> have mercy jesus <laughs> Up here telling business. Oh, stop it. You tell business. Bye. Bye.